it's a very significant day because some of the things that it shows is a reinforcement of the fact that COVID-19 is real. I, for one, was one person that did not even believe this COVID existed at all. I was in this hospital with my grandma. I experienced some um, symptoms and then it was like, okay, those are core symptoms of COVID, so you have to go for the test and all. Okay, so when I went for the test, I went back home because I had to leave. I could not stay with her because of it was very possible for me to infect her. So they told me to distance myself from everybody for now until my test result was out. So when I went back home and then I was called and told that my test result was positive. Heaven knows that I cried for one whole day because I was like, ah, something that I never believed existed. Okay, I think God wanted to use me as an evidence to tell people that COVID-19 is really, really real. Remember that it is real, but also remember that we can overcome COVID-19. What we are here to do is to celebrate the mercy of God upon us and to thank His Excellency, the Executive Governor of Akwaibom State, Mr. Udum Emmanuel, for his great support and passion for the health of the citizens of this state. We thank him very much. I want to say a very big thank you to the government, the Kwaibom State government, because they've been, they've been amazing. Like the, the, the effort they put into this um, COVID is, is amazing. Our frontline as the doctors, I want to say a very big thank you to all of them and to our almighty God for making me a testimony today. So I would like to advise everyone out there, please and please stay safe. Do the necessary, um, the basic uh, preventive measures wash your hands, social distancing and all. Please observe social distancing and wear your mask. Don't wait to be told. This sickness is real. Pass the message, not the virus. It's critical that we pass the correct message at the time when we are reopening the economy. As you are aware that markets have been reopened with a caveat on the protocols involved. You are aware that schools for exit classes have been reopened with a caveat. Therefore, the duty of care passes to individual responsibility. We must be responsible both for ourselves and for the people around us. Parents must be responsible that their children wear masks to school. Parents must practice social distancing even at home so that the children will understand clearly the situation that we have on hand.